two people are dead and one wounded after a shooting in Brussels. Belgium's soccer team was hosting Sweden in a Euro 2024 qualifying match. Authorities say people were gathered at a cafe to watch the football game when a man started shooting an automatic weapon. Two Swedish nationals were killed. Belgium's prime minister gave his thoughts. Last night, three people left for what was supposed to be a wonderful soccer party. Two of them lost their lives in a brutal terrorist attack. Their lives were cut short in full flight, cut down by extreme brutality. The attack took place about three miles from the Belgian National Stadium, where the match was held. At the game's halftime, the decision was made for the Swedish and Belgian soccer teams to stop playing. But authorities kept fans in the stadium for safety, evacuating them around midnight. We were watching the match and they told us that the match wasn't going to happen anymore and that the trams, tram and metro stations were closed and we had to wait for more information. And now they've finally evacuated the stadium. Authorities are describing the shooting as a terrorist attack. The suspected gunman was killed in a confrontation with police. A moment of silence will be observed at all Euro 2024 qualifying matches on October 17th to honor the victims in Brussels. This is Inside Edition Digital.